Have you ever wondered if a cracked snail shell can grow back? It's a question that has piqued the curiosity of many, sparking an exploration into the fascinating world of snails. The shell of a snail isn't just an exterior decoration, it's a vital part of their anatomy, serving as a mobile home, a shield against predators, and a reservoir for essential minerals. A snail's shell is so intricately linked with its existence that a damaged shell can profoundly impact its life, often leading to dire consequences. Imagine carrying your house on your back and having it crack. The very thought is unsettling, isn't it? Now consider this. What if you could simply grow it back? Snails, these small, seemingly insignificant creatures, are believed to possess this amazing ability, but can a snail really mend its broken shell? Let's delve into the science behind snail shell regeneration. Snail shells are not just homes, they are a crucial part of a snail's body structure. They serve as a protective shield, but they're also unique works of biological architecture constructed from an intriguing mix of materials. At the heart of this construction is calcium carbonate, a substance you might recognize from chalk or limestone. This calcium carbonate, along with a blend of proteins, forms the hard protective layer we recognize as the snail's shell. But where does this calcium come from? It's not conjured out of thin air, but rather it is derived from the snail's diet. Snails consume calcium-rich food, which they then use to strengthen their shells. Like a tiny mason, a snail can repair minor shell damage. When a crack or chip appears, the snail secretes more calcium carbonate to fill in the damaged area. It's a natural, albeit slow, process of regeneration. However, it's important to note that this repair mechanism has its limits. When a snail's shell suffers severe damage, it may not be able to recover. This is because the snail may not have enough available calcium to repair the damage or the damage may be too extensive. In such cases, the snail can become vulnerable to predators and the elements, which can ultimately lead to its demise. So, while a snail can repair minor shell damage, it's always best to prevent shell damage in the first place. Now that we understand the science behind snail shell regeneration, how can we help our slimy friends? Well, a calcium-rich diet is key for strong shells. Also, arranging a safe environment devoid of sharp or abrasive surfaces prevents shell damage. To fully grasp snail care, do download our snail care checklist from the description section. Remember, prevention is always better than cure. Let's do our part to keep these fascinating creatures safe and healthy. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share if you've enjoyed this video.